For more North Idaho Newsroom tonight, the Coeur d'Alene School District is beefing up security. Tomorrow, Ramsey Elementary, Woodland Middle School, and Coeur d'Alene High will implement a three-week pilot program to test a new video buzzing system to make day-to-day -day operations safer. KXY Force Casey Lund working for you to show you the new system. The Coeur d'Alene School District will use this three-week pilot program to work out any kinks with this new technology. They hope to have the technology in all 17 of their schools by mid-February. The video buzz-in system is just part of a larger emphasis the school district's trying to put on security. No one thinks it can happen in their community, and we know it can happen anywhere. Superintendent Matt Handelman remembers well the days following the unthinkable events in Newtown, Connecticut a year ago. Right after Sandy, the, the Sandy Hook, uh, tragedy, we had um, a big meeting with law enforcement from our area where we said to them, well, what can we do right off the bat, money or not, to, uh, to make our schools safer. Voters approved a $1.4 million levy to make that happen. It added more resource officers, fenced-in school grounds, and video surveillance everywhere. It's all about the kids and their safety. Also about our staff. We, we know that you know, Sandy Hook, um, several staff members lost their lives as well. And, and so we care about all the people who we work with and obviously about all the kids who we, we serve. The new buzz-in system is simple. When visitors come to the school, they'll push a button at the main entrance. A staff member at the front desk will be able to see who's trying to get in through a small camera. Once that person is identified and cleared, they'll be buzzed in. Handelman admits that security measures like this aren't something he likes to see at his schools, but the world we live in is changing, and the people tasked every day with keeping children safe have to adapt. The district asks parents to be patient as the new system is implemented over the next month. Reporting in Coeur d'Alene, Casey Lund, KXLY 4 News.